Why does diverse teams matter when it comes down to developing and executing many ideas? And it comes down to it because diverse teams create exponentially more ideas, which suggests that you can develop breakthrough strategies through the explicit use of diversity and inclusion. What I'm saying is that if you have a diverse team, you have a better shot at coming after any challenge or any opportunity because they're looking at it from perspectives that others hadn't seen before. Let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. We have this hospital in uh, Cambridge, in the UK, and they have a particular challenge, right? So every time they're transferring patients from the, from the surgical unit to the intensive care unit, you have two separate teams trying to manage this patient. And because you have two separate teams, you have an issue around collaboration. And because there's issue collaboration, there's errors. And these errors can sometimes be fatal. So now the hospital is trying to solve this problem. And the obvious thing to do would be to look at how have other hospitals solved this problem? What is best practices in this field? But they didn't. Instead, they teamed up with McLaren to try to understand what happens at a pit stop in a Formula One car race. And when they started looking at it that way, they realized that there are connections between what happens in the op room and in the hospital and what happens at a pit stop crew. And once they started to take lessons from that, they were then able to reshift how they thought about collaborating between these teams and drop error rates and save lives. So now the pit stop model is one that is spreading in hospitals around the world. And you can see that the diversity of the team, if leveraged, makes the team faster, particularly under these circumstances. Makes them leaner. So to wrap up, use diversity and inclusion to drive innovation.